Hey guys, a quick, quick video about inflation and why the price of Luna is currently trading at 0 0.00002943 and a very cautionary tale about buying the dip. So if you were to buy Terra on its way down, trying to time the bottom, the bottom air quotes, you will get burned every single step of the way. Keep in mind that there's a misconception about a price of an asset at a certain point. Let's say the price of the asset is at a dollar and it fell from a hundred dollars. You'll be like, hey, if I buy this, if it goes back to a hundred bucks, I could make a hundred times my return. I could only lose a dollar at most, right? But a lot of newbies don't understand is that that dollar could fall even further to 10 cents. In that case, you lose 90% of your investments. So it doesn't matter where you buy in at, there's always a chance for you to lose everything or majority of your investment. Even if it's at one cent, you could buy in and then if it drops to half a cent, you lose 50% of your investment. So please keep in mind of this thing before you go into any trying to buy the dip at anything. Now Luna was trading at 0 0.03 cents. 3 cents. That was yesterday. Look at today. It actually went even further. This is... I don't even know what this number is. 0 0.000... Like, it's insane. So why is this? No, that's the first cautionary tale. So let's talk about inflation. Why is the price of Luna continue to drop like this? It's basically crashing. Well, if you look at the UST token, the current peg is at 0.24 cents. That is incredible. That's not even a dollar. It's losing its peg. That means people have been selling all of their UST stable, well, supposedly stable coin, in order to redeem Luna. Now, the problem is the mechanism of this algorithm is that every UST dollar, every dollar of UST is redeemable for a dollar worth of Luna. Now, can you imagine? Whenever you redeem, new Luna gets created. They just mint it out of their treasury minted out of the contract. So when you do that, you can see that, let's say I want a dollar worth of Luna. How much is this? Th that's like 3 million coins or something, 300,000, 3 million coins or whatever. But as you can see, this problem gets worse and worse as the price of this gets lower and lower, as the price of Luna gets lower and lower. This is a, count, a exponential inflation that's happening here. And as the price of this dips and people want their dollar worth of Luna, dollar worth of Luna, every time this price goes lower, a dollar worth of Luna goes even more. You can get even more Luna coin for a dollar. So that is exactly what this is. If you look at the Luna's history supply, look how fast this has grown. So even like four days ago, there were a total of 775 million Luna coins, right? So remember, when the supply is low, the price is up. However, if the supply is a lot, then nobody wants it because there's so much of them out there, right? Nobody will willing to pay much money for it. That's when Luna was around, I don't know, $50 or something. And then a day after, it's $2.6 billion. That is insane. That's about four times in a day. Four times the total supply in a day. And then a day later, this is $211 billion, like Luna coins. That's a 200 times increase in supply in a day. And then one day later, this is 6.9 trillion. Think about it. This is an exponential curve. This is an exponential increase in the number of supply. And that is why the price of Luna is exponentially dropped every single day. So this, well, at this point, this is pretty much worthless. And this tells you about the whole algorithm of this coin and how there's a weakness. When everybody sells the UST and don't believe in it, they go, they redeem their Luna, but as more... Luna are created, the value of Luna decreases. And every time somebody wants to redeem after that, you have to pay even more Luna just to get the dollar worth. So that's how everybody's bank account became zero, essentially. So I hope this is a hard lesson. It's hard for all of us. And I hope you guys are doing okay. And I hope this video is helpful for you to understand how this whole thing works. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Please like and subscribe.